everybody. Welcome back to Profits Unlimited's podcast channel. Got something really going to be a short video we're going to talk about today, but it's the value of joining associations. Whether it's your local chapter of an association or a state chapter or a national chapter of an association, regardless of what it is, we made the mistake with our business of not getting involved with different associations. And I think it's something, as business owners and managers, we all need to be more involved than we actually are. Because, you know, my mindset with my own company initially was, man, I don't have time for that. You know, it's something else I got to do either in the morning or in the evening, or if it's a lunch thing, whatever it may be. I just never had time for any of that. I didn't see the importance of making time to be involved in associations. And I don't mean necessarily having to take a board position, but just being involved at any level, whether it's just a membership or whatever it may be. And you say, well, okay, well, how do I set that time aside? You know, as business owners and business managers, we got to look at ourselves and say, okay, how can we set aside and how do we time better time manage ourselves, basically? And what I found over 40 years of being in business is and my dad always told me this. He said, Wayne, if you want to get something done, you find something, somebody busy. And I think that is very, very true when we really sit down and look at it. Are you busy? If you're busy, you'll find time to do something. We can always find a reason not to do it, right? But if we want to, we can also find the time to do something. And what's the value in an association? Well, I think just for the sake of time today, Let's look at it from a pride and professionalism standpoint real quick. What I saw happening when I started getting involved in associations was all of a sudden it was putting a name and a face to a competitor rather than just somebody, you know, that I saw out on the street or, you know, in a wave at them or whatever it may be. You know, when you're, when you're actually with somebody and you finally meet somebody and you talk to somebody, all of a sudden, they're no longer just the company name. They're actually Billy or Mary or Jane or Sue or whoever. You know, all of a sudden you've attached an identity to that person and that person has attached an identity to you. So even though you may pay a little bit of membership fee money, you know, it's a great opportunity to realize that, you know what, we're all in this together. Whether, regardless of the business that you're in, you know, it can be a service-related business. It can be anything. But regardless of the industry that you're in, it puts names and faces together. It's a great networking opportunity because there's going to be things that you do within your company that, and there's going to be things that you don't do that some of the other members do as well. And you've got somebody that you can trust to maybe send your customer to that may be providing a, a service or a product that you don't necessarily have, but you want to be the source for your customer to come so they have confidence in you and your company, knowing that, hey, this referral's coming from Wayne, or this referral's coming from Billy, or this referral's coming from Sue, and I trust them. So now you keep your customer from shopping somewhere else, basically. So that that's one thing it does. The professionalism that I saw where it helped our company with, it just takes you to another level. You know, your customers may not know, you know, the associations you're involved with, but it looks good on your business cards. It looks good on your letterhead. It looks good on your vehicles, maybe. You know, if you're in that, that environment, as far as what type of business you're running, it just creates a little more credibility, a little more professionalism for you. From a pride standpoint, I think it helps as well. You know, because it gives you a chance to say, hey, I care about what I'm doing. I'm just not out here hammering it out every day, out in the street or in your office or wherever it is, whatever it is you do. But it helps you see that pride. You know, and we use the acronym within our business for pride of professional results and daily efforts. What are you doing on a daily basis to create additional pride within your company? Because if you've got pride and your employees have pride, that pride and professionalism flows through you and through them to who? Your customers. 
And I think an easy way to do that and a very inexpensive way to do that is get involved more with your local associations, with your state associations, you know, even at a national association level. You may not be, you know, meeting as much and you say, well, what's the most important thing? I certainly can't do them all. I would say start at your local level because those are the people and your competitors at a local level are the ones that need to see as a group that you're all more professional. And then also get involved. And then once you see what happens at that level, you'll want to be part of that state association or that national association because you'll see the benefits of it. So get involved. You do have time to do it. You just got to set aside the time to do it. And remember, profit is not a dirty word. Hey everybody, thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave us a comment below and we will get back to you soon. If you aren't already, please subscribe to our channel. Also, go like our Facebook page where you can interact with us and the whole Profits Unlimited community. Check out our great website with all of our 100% money back guaranteed products at ProfitsRUs.com. And remember, stay tuned for the latest and greatest content from us at Profits Unlimited.